Have you ever wondered what secrets the Pleistocene epoch holds? What was the life of an ancient wolf like during this time? Today, we delve into a remarkable discovery that provides an unprecedented glimpse into this intriguing era. In the cold expanse of the Siberian permafrost, a treasure was unearthed in 2021. Locals discovered an incredibly well-preserved wolf at an astonishing depth of about 130 feet along the Tarktok River in Russia's coldest region. The find was swiftly reported to the scientific community and whisked away to the Mammoth Museum Laboratory of the Northeast Federal University in Yakutsk for further study. The permafrost, a perennially frozen ground, is a natural preserver of organic material across millennia. This ancient wolf, likely the oldest of its kind to undergo such an exhaustive analysis, is a testament to the permafrost's preserving prowess. Its fur, bones, internal organs, and most strikingly, its teeth, remained remarkably intact. The wolf's pristine condition allowed scientists to perform an in-depth autopsy, unlocking invaluable insights into the fauna and flora of the Pleistocene period. Dr. Albert Protopopov, head of the Mammoth Fauna Study Department of the Yakutia Academy of Sciences, underscored the significance of the wolf's stomach. It remained uncontaminated and isolated, offering a rare chance to study the diet and ecosystem of ancient predators directly. Dr. Maxim Cheprasov, head of the Mammoth Museum Laboratory, extracted a premolar tooth to ascertain the wolf's biological age. The wear of the teeth and the development of the sagittal crest confirmed the specimen as an adult male. One of the most thrilling aspects of this discovery is the preservation of the wolf's stomach contents. This provides a snapshot of the ancient biota, shedding light on what the wolf and its prey consumed. This information aids in reconstructing the Pleistocene ecosystem and understanding the predator-prey dynamics of the era. But there's more. The potential discovery of live bacteria within the wolf's remains paves the way for research in microbiology and biotechnology. Professor Artemy Goncharov, head of the Functional Genomics and Proteomics Laboratory at the Institute of Experimental Medicine, pointed out that ancient bacteria could survive for millennia within fossil remains. These microorganisms could offer insights into ancient microbial communities and their roles, including the presence of pathogenic bacteria. The study of these ancient microorganisms could lead to modern-day applications in medicine and biotechnology. Researchers aim to identify biologically active substances that ancient bacteria produced, which could have contemporary therapeutic or industrial uses. Permafrost regions, like those in Siberia, Alaska, and Canada, serve as natural time capsules, preserving organic matter for thousands of years. These areas are critical for studying Earth's geological and climatic history. The frozen ground encapsulates vast secrets of our planet's past, and as we unravel them, we gain a deeper understanding of our world's incredible journey through time.